Looking to end a BB gun shooting spree before anyone else gets hurt. And now one victim is speaking exclusively with Eyewitness News. There have been two attacks along Rose Tree Road in Upper Providence Township. Eyewitness News reporter Elizabeth Herr has our exclusive details. Here's the room right here. Shot in the neck with a BB gun. It was like fully notched in there. 15 year old Eric Goldhorn had to have the BB removed at a hospital. I did not expect that to happen. Like, I don't know, like, it's weird. Doctor said that if it was one inch over, it would have hit his main artery in his neck and he possibly could have bled out on site. It happened during one of his routine runs down Dog Kennel Road last Wednesday afternoon. Police say the same culprits may have struck again this Tuesday, less than a mile away, in the parking lot of the Sunoco station. A 28-year-old woman, according to police, was approached from behind by someone asking for a cigarette. When she turned around, she was shot in the eye, police say, with a BB gun. We even decided today for a while to just stay off the roads. Those who live and jog in the area are nervous. I was pretty scared about that. Running together, I would consider that safe, but not alone. Goldhorn says he is out running again, perhaps more watchful now after falling victim to someone inside a small gray sedan. car looks full. It probably was young people. It's crazy. It's taken, you know, if it's kids doing this, it's taken BBs. I mean, it's taken it to a new level. They, now you're trying to hurt people. It's not just fun. In addition to the two incidents here, police say a third victim, a man reported that he was hit with a BB gun this Monday, this in nearby Tinicum Township. Now, police say at this time it is unclear if all three cases are connected, and that is why they're asking anyone with information to please give them a call. Reporting from Upper Providence Township, I'm Elizabeth Hur, CBS 3 Eyewitness News. All right, Liz.